Most people say you need paid tools to start a business, but I'm using Apollo AI completely free and it works. In this video, I'm going to show you how to use Apollo AI, the free version. I'm going to show you in this video how I specifically find leads that are close to me in the northwest of England, but you can do the same in any area that you're in. I'm just going to show you how to utilize a free version like I do. In case you don't know what Apollo IO is, it's basically a massive business to business database. So there's, you know, contact details for emails and that type of stuff just to connect businesses to each other. Let's dive in and I'll show you what I'm doing. Okay, because uh, as you can see, this is the homepage. Um, they've recently updated this, so it looks like this at the minute. Um, they've got all our things on the left. So what we want to do though from the free version, um, from this section here, we want to use people. This is how we're going to find our our clients basically and um, this persona se section at the top this is just you can do presets of any particular ones to, to choose what you want on there you can just go in there pick job titles that type of stuff if you want to know more let, let me know i'll show you how to do that and um, but we're not going to use any of them today so all i'm going to do is from this point i'm going to just show you the location so obviously i'm for me i'm going to go to the united kingdom you could choose anywhere you want. As you can see, it's already starting to upload some of the businesses from the side. At the minute, the total is like, I don't know, 11 million or something it says. Um, but you can then break that down by address. So zip codes, if you're in America, postcodes for us in the UK. I'm just gonna put the city in and then within the miles distance. So I'm just gonna go Liverpool within 50 miles. You can also select the regions above. So I'll just show you that quickly. So yeah, from there, I'm just going to type in Liverpool. It'll give me the choice. And I'll pick the UK. Instantly, it's just brought me up with a load of lists here. Um, but the, the list is still too big. So I want to try and narrow it down a bit more. I can change that by employees. And the keywords is one that works really well. So industry for this example, I'm just going to put automotive. Just so, you know, for me, if I was going to do some videos for cars or whatever so automotive but then i want to use keywords with inside that um, and this is a great tool that allows you to do that so in here let's see i'll type showroom press enter that'll give me one little bit um classic cars just so i can show you how i break that down a little bit and you can see the total at the top there now has just changed and that's whittled it down I find this is probably a little bit easier for me to understand it and now it allows me to search closer to where I want. Um, as you can see, there's some new AI features and stuff like that which I haven't played around with yet. Buying intent is something from previous. Sequences is when you've got like more paid versions, you can do sequences so it gives automatic responses and that type of stuff. And then all them locked ones are just because of where it's for the free version. Um, open emails again this works better when you've got the paid version because you can see who's opening emails and that's been put through their system so say someone searched it before and said yes and it's been opened they know that it was a good success rate coming from that so as you can see at the top i've got 42 close local to me if i then go to the top and i select this page and I press apply, it'll then give me the options at the top so I can, I can save that list, I can just email that 25 straight away, add them to a sequence, but nine times out of 10, I'll export it. This little window will pop up just to tell you what emails are verified. Some of them haven't been, emails missing for some of the contacts, so really there's only 12 out of this list. I then press next, and then again, I can have them same options at the top, but I want to export it as a document for an Excel sheet, really. Um, export that, click that I want to edit, and then just press save. And that's exactly how I get my client list. Basically, that's how you use Apollo IO for free. That's how you can get outreach to clients, start reaching people, getting your name out there, wear the mouth. Look, all they can do is say no. Just about being consistent. If you're doing the same or you're thinking about it, you've tried using Apollo IO and never really got your head around it, or you've been using something else, but it's always paying, paying, paying. Like I say, 
I know it's only a few credits or whatever, but you can do it for free. I know there's better features if you do it with the paid versions, but honestly, you can get by by doing it free. It's exactly what I'm doing. If you're thinking of doing the same, drop a comment below. Let me know what you're working on. Don't forget, hit that like, subscribe. New YouTubers, let's all gather here. As I keep saying, seeing all over the place. Let's do it. If you don't know what my journey is about already, check out this little video here. Give you a little, just give you a bit of a background of the journey that I'm trying to start on. Until next week, see you later.